So guys, for the first step, you're gonna head over to search and type in services, click on it. Now once you're on this, you're gonna click on any service and then click on W on your keyboard. Then you want to scroll down until you find Windows time. You want to double click on it. And then you want to change the startup type to automatic delayed start. And then click on okay. And now you're gonna double click on it again. And now you're gonna click on start. So make sure that the service status is running and that the startup type is an automatic delayed start. And then click on okay. But if you already got to this stage and it was already running and it was already an automatic delayed start, then you want to click on restart the service. And now for the second step, you want to head over to search and type in date and time settings. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to make sure you have set time automatically on and that your time zone is also correct. And now you want to click on sync now. If this does not work, then you want to restart your computer and then come back into date and time settings and then click on sync now again and then the problem should be fixed.